Senecare is uh, the local Catholic um, welfare agency uh, for the Diocese of the Riverina. Wagga is our head office. Um, we have a, a broad range across the, the Riverina. We offer a range of services and we also provide a range of support services for young people from migrant and refugee backgrounds. The group I'm involved in is Kayak, that's the abbreviation, and it's for Kids Advisory Youth Committee, Committee with a K. It was through Centre Care that the committee was formed. It's a group of youth in Wagga. Some are from Sudan, some are from Sierra Leone, some are from Uganda. So it's kind of a variety of people from different parts of the world. And we kind of meet and discuss issues that go on in Wagga and problems and how we could help to make it better for the youth. At the moment, we are discussing the youth and how they could get employment. And recently, I've made a couple of applications that I got one interview for. So it's been really helpful because I had no idea about such things when I came in here. Working in the TV industry, so um, how can I get a portfolio once I finish? I came from Sierra Leone with my grandmother 2005 in June. I came here as a refugee and I'm currently um, I'm residing in Wagga Wagga. I'm currently studying TV production. I love pictures and, uh, um, and I love singing as well. So when I was in high school, um, I just um, decided to um, do something with media. I'm hoping to work in Sydney or camera um, as a camera person or working in the studio. I would love to do something like that to be very good you know for other people to see um, how different people um, make their journey from a refugee background into Australia and um, all the changes that have happened in their life once they've arrived in Australia. With Kayak, it's getting them together to tell us about some of the issues they're going through and we respond in the best way that we can for them. We've been doing lots of work with um, assessment help and lots of work with job applications and just um, filling forms. So lots of them have been coming in for that. We just let them come in whenever they need, they need assistance, they come in.